Make sure if you guys are just coming in, you hit the live button, wherever it is, to make sure you are current in the stream. I keep getting a little bit of splash back. Hey, how are you? What's going on? I'm trying to be super positive today. So how you doing? I just got back from probation and I was telling her how, you know, like in a way I'm kind of grateful that I'm on probation because it's like extra incentive to be the best person that I can be. Hey, Alyssa, how are you guys? How are you guys? I've been like bitching about my life so much lately. How are you guys doing? That's what I really want to know. Like what, how are you guys doing? Oh, I got to fix this because I figured out that top chat, like it's automatically set to top chat, but I have to hit live chat. I'm glad that I remembered that today. You need a good laugh? Don't leave. Oh. Thanks, Alyssa. You need a good laugh. Let's see. Aside from... I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I love you. What's going on? What's got, you know, everybody's in such a funk lately. I'll tell you. Everybody's going through a bunch of stuff lately. All right. Oh my God, I tried, what, do you know what app that emoji thing is? Like, cause I saw that emoji thing you sent me and I wanted to download it. Let me tell you guys, I will say this, the CRPS in my foot and my leg is killing me right now. Like it fucking hurts. Like I can't tell if I want to be seated or standing or like leaning. What'd you find up there, kitty? I think I need to close the air vents because I keep getting little like splats in my mouth. Try and get as much of it out as I can in my mouth and just spit it. <laughs> it sounds so gross, but. Did I get it all? I totally feel that. I totally feel that. I'm sorry. Yeah, I just called today about uh, a bill. And I had to pay like every penny that I had just to like pay it. Everybody's going through some tough stuff right now. But you know what? That's why we're here to help each other go get through it. Right? How far are you, how far behind are you? If you don't mind me asking. You never know. Like we all try to help each other. Maybe somebody in the chat would be helpful. Do you have some type of food stamp thing? Like in your area? Hey, I've missed you. Do you make too much or something? Is that why? The poverty line keeps changing, which sucks. It's like it takes you have to be like literally dirt, dirt, dirt broke. And it's like, like even like uh, my workers comp is like so cheap, so cheap. And um. I barely, and, and I'm almost above the poverty line, which is crazy, crazy, because it's not even enough to cover my rent, like, <laughs> hey, Courtney, I hope you guys are all doing good.
It's hot today. It's hot. I can't do the heat. I miss you. Miss you too. I know things have been really stressful on your end. Yeah, I was. I'm a little late today. I know. I had a whole bunch of stuff to do this morning to get done. I got a bunch of paperwork I have to hand in. Um, uh, a bunch of phone. It was just a really super busy morning. But now I'm like done with it pretty much. I love mixing these. I'm sure. Well, if you think about it, think about it. If you have. Like, let's say, like, you're $100 behind, and you have four friends who each want to give you $20 to help you. You know? Need a time machine. Uh-oh. Well, this is why I've been um talking on my computer lately, so that you guys can text me if you want while I'm doing this. Did I just put it? <laughs> Me either. Same. Same. <coughs> I keep getting like... Max, I didn't expect you to be here. I'm glad you are, though. <coughs> ATN. Wait, what was ATN? Hold on, let me Google it. I'm sorry. ATN. My brain is like fried. Oh. Okay, so you're, how are, like, but you're taking the medicine, so does the medicine make you feel drunk? Yeah, there's, like, uh, churches around here that will do the same thing. You should see if there's one in your area. I'm doing good. Oh no, Courtney, what happened? Yep, happens to me all the time. Just take naps until you feel better. Naps and naps and naps. It's really, it's surprisingly, people say like, you know, sleeping your life away, but when you're sleeping, your body heals itself the most. Hey, Amber. I have my um camera recording because I'm going to record a video today, too. Right? Sleep heals my soul, too. I love sleeping. So lately, though, I've been, like, waking up feeling really crappy when I sleep. Almost like when I first got on methadone and um, I used to like fall asleep and wake up and feel like in withdrawal. Like I've been going through that again. It's really weird. Oh, that's not good, Kate. It is. Sometimes it really is hard to cut ties, Courtney. I completely agree with that. I completely agree. How long have you been close with this person? Yeah, that is good, Kate. Sleep is important. Three days. Damn. Right? I could sleep forever, too. 
especially with like my leg being the way that it is. And it's been like really painful. Like it's always in pain, but like it's been really painful lately. So I've been like, like laying on my side. We all love sleeping. How are you all doing? I want to hear from each and every one of you guys, like, like sobriety wise, like, and you know, physically and like mentally, how are you all doing? Like, like, and like, is there anything you guys want to like talk about? Is there anything like that anybody feels like they want to talk about today? I feel like I like I've talked about myself and I've bitched so much lately, and you guys have been such a support to me. I want to feel like you know I want to support you guys today. Courtney, it's, you're a good person. That's pretty much what we are nicely done. That's what I want this to be. Well, that's good that you're okay now. You're in pain today. I'm really sorry you're in pain today. What's today? But the kids are in school, right? So at least you got the day to try and relax a little bit. No, Amber. They got to have it on camera, though. They got to, right? Well, once it starts to get boring, Max, then just go and lay down. Um, and, it, well, Ronnie, if you want, I can read what it is, It's but that's with your permission. Hey, absent-minded. I hope she reported it. I know, right, Max? All of the the whole family's here. I think. Well, not Pixie. Pixie hasn't been here, but Pixie's going through a lot right now. So it's and Brad's not here, and Rob's not here, Jake's not here. But actually, I'm gonna text Pixie right now. I don't know where Rob's been. He commented on my Facebook like a week ago. Okay, so you, I can read what ATN is. Um, all right, so that you guys know. I hope so, too. She's so sweet. ATN medical definition. Um, acute tubular necrosis is a medical condition involving the death of a tubular epithelial cells that form the renal tubules of the kidneys. ATN presents with acute kidney, acute kidney injury and is one of the most common causes of AKI, um, including low blood pressure and use of nephrotoxic drugs. The low blood pressure is probably, why, that's not it. I'm wrong. Hold on. Wait. What? Oh, okay. Can I read about what that is? I have to type that in. I wonder why it didn't show up. Yeah, CC hasn't been here in a while either. Trium. Oh, found it. Oh, okay. It's a disorder in the cranial nerve. Oh, it's a painful, it sounds. And it overlaps with other um, disorders, too. That does not sound fun. Is it in your face? So it's like right here, right? My driver's license is my driver's license. Well, did you report it? Are they going to pull the cameras? They fucking better. 
I have that too, um, Ashley. Like when I lay on my side too, like like I can't my if I lay on my back, my arms go numb too sometimes. I think that's pinched nerves. I miss Rob's jokes too. I know I feel really bad for that for what Amber's gonna do. Um, jaws, teeth, and face. Ow, that sounds so painful. I'm really sorry you're dealing with that, Ronnie. God, we all have such bad health issues. We're all dying. Like this is horrible. <laughs> And I can say that because I have illnesses too. <laughs> we just need to try and be healthy as I drink this iced coffee and smoke my babe. Oh, my probation officer told me today to look something up. Okay, so I'm going to look this up for all of us vapors. Okay, it's called popcorn lung and it's something you can get from vaping. She told me to look it up. All right, let's see. Um. All right, let's see. I guess that um, vaping can cause this thing called popcorn lung, which is a serious and irreversible condition in which tiny air sacs in the lung become scarred and constricted, which results in no air movement or O2 CO2 exchange in the lungs. Ugh. Damn. You know, we thought we found a safer alternative. Right, Courtney. Gina's new merch shirt. I had merch for a while, actually. Do you guys know that? There were sweatshirts and stuff, and they said um slay like on the corner. But I couldn't figure out how to get it to work right. Maybe I should make merch. What should it say? If I were to make merch, what would it say? Popcorn lung? Like <laughs> some lungs with some popcorn in the mint? We're all broken and poor. <laughs> I'm going to write some of these down. Because if I ever do, and you guys will all, everyone in this chat right now is going to get, would get a free shirt. All right. Let's see. I want some ideas. So we're all broken and poor. I want some more ideas. That scares me too. Stuff like that scares me too. Oh, yeah, I would never surrender on back. That's a really, because they go together well. <laughs> That's a good one. Can we spell addicted like a dick? Like, instead of like like a d d i c k t e d just to make it funny i love you too amber let's form our own cult of people that aren't full of shit <laughs> right that's what we're doing that's like literally what we're doing absent minded what should we do? I'm going to maybe a popcorn lung where it's like a picture of like, like an outline of a lung and pieces of popcorn falling all over the place. That would be cool. <laughs> what else should I do? I had this, I'll bring back the sleigh hoodies. I'm writing these down. So like, I need some ideas. I'm trash, dude. That's like, cause we are like, well, I am, I'm literal trash. <laughs> Wow, Max, that sucks. Yeah, gabapentin is really good for nerve pain, Ronnie. 
That is a very good idea, absence-minded. Well, I'll do mine better. <laughs> I'm a dick. Did the Gina fan. Like, I'm a dick. Because I am a dick. But I want to change our name. Because, like, I don't like Gina. I talked to Max about this any the other day. I don't like the name Gina fam anymore. Because we wouldn't be the Gina fam if it wasn't for you guys. So, like, I want to change our name. <laughs> Yeah, you got to be careful with Gabapen. So there's a, um, a ceiling on it or whatever it's called. I don't know yet, Amanda. I don't know. I'll know today, actually. I will know today. They're doing the background check today. Oh, that sucks, Ronnie. It's just not working for her, I don't think. Oh, hold on one second, guys. I got to take a phone call real quick. Hold Sorry, guys, I had to take that. You guys know that I try to help people all the time. So, all right, let me scroll up and read a little bit. All right. Or, like, clean on. All right, so let's see. Clean on the front, but trash on the back. Or clean on the front, but still dirty on the back. Right? Oh. Clean on front. Still dirty or trash on back. Um, 
Okay, real quick, I just want to make it clear. I just want to make it clear. Because we were talking about gabapentin and things like that in the chat, um, we're not talking about abusing drugs, and we're talking about taking a non-narcotic medication that helps people who have a chronic pain disease. So if anybody is triggered by that, I'm very sorry, And but there's this is the, the reality of what my channel is. I just want to put that out there real quick. Um, you know, like a lot of people like myself, I also have a chronic pain disease. So please don't feel like, um, you know, uh, like, I'm sorry if that affects you in a negative way that we talk about this stuff. But, you know, and all, it is a real thing like chronic disease and chronic pain. Like I have CRPS. I am also treated with gabapentin, except for I haven't, I still don't have a doctor right now. So, all right, let me go back to what I'm saying, to what I'm reading. Um, Amber, I had to mute it for a second because I had to take a personal phone call. Yeah, I just don't want to start have anybody get upset again. I should write, make one that says trigger, triggering, not trigger, triggering, <laughs> triggering, ring, ring. Am I in trouble, Ronnie? Oh, you're in the doghouse. The internet is just triggering in general. <laughs> Epilepsy taught me how to dance. <laughs> <laughs> <coughs> nobody is abusing I know nobody really talks about abusing drugs like that that often and if they do and if I were to see it I would call it out and but I, I I miss a lot of comments sometimes but I was talking to um and I, I love Sly Fox when she was in here the other day we were talking about how like I miss a lot of comments and sometimes people do talk about things that are inappropriate and I need to try harder to catch that Did you know that my first words, my first word, like most of the time it's like mom or like dad. My first word was broken. <laughs> like what? <laughs> like, so they used to call me broken Gina. Really weird, right? <laughs> How real though? How real is that? I don't have contour on my face today. I might grab my stuff and contour my face with you guys so we can see the difference. Do you want to do that? I think that would be fun. Can't break. What is it real? Oh my God, where am I? <laughs> That's crazy, Kate. Hold on. I'm going to grab my stuff real quick. I want to like, <laughs> I want to do that. I started doing it different. Hold on. I used to, uh, I usually use creams to do this, but I'm just going to do it straight with what I'm looking at, like straight into the thing. Wait, what phrase? I don't, I love this for contouring. I don't want it. It's almost gone though, but I'm going to use it anyways. I'm going to try and do it by just looking into the thing. I'm going to do one side first. No mirror.
Dude, it's really hard at first because, like, if you go heavy-handed, it looks crazy in person. Oh, there's a mirror. Perfect. I learned that if the fur if you keep it back, like further in the back, it just like looks a lot better. You know, I never really figured out like a hundred percent how to use this contour kit. It's really hard. It's already starting to take shape. Isn't that interesting? Aww. So much better already on one side. But it's like, so, like on my thing, it looks like not as dark as it really is in person, but I'm not going anywhere today. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, baby. Missy Blush. Who? Wait, you're nervous for who? Oh, I love you, Dawn. Thank you. I got this in Bouncy Chat. It's like hard to see. Like, I'm just gonna finish there. But like looking head on, it makes like such a difference. Such a difference. Oh, really, Kate? Yeah, this contour kit in person, though, you never want to use this, like, to go out with. Because look how crazy the contour colors are. I don't even know. And this was, like, super expensive. I got it a long time ago. I don't know why I did. They're straight grays. Like, straight up. Like, like it's so complicated to use. Like, right now, because, like, I'm on a live stream and it's a bad camera, it looks okay. But, like, in all reality, like, it's a pain. I know. I can't wait for this one's boxy charm either. That's awesome, Nicely Done. I'm glad that you chat with us. What channels are becoming toxic? 
I hope I hope mine never does. Thank you, Amber. And if it does, like, please tell me. I I would want to know. You know, if anyone ever felt like my channel was turning that way, tell me what I what you think I should do to make it better. I'm not going to guarantee that I would, but I would at least listen to the advice of others, you know. Let's go Rihanna. Bring that blush all the way up. Bring that shit all the way up. Makes my head look small and my body look cute. <laughs> That's awesome. Thank you. Danny needs some more cowbell. I think I read that before. I think you were Kistag, and I think I said I was going to call you cowbell. Is it like Negs and stuff? Negs won't talk to me. What do you mean a picture? Okay, good. I don't want to have anything to do with that. I always want to try and be as positive as I can be. I want to know who this is so I can watch. Give me um a hint and I'll or say the name and I'll delete it real quick. I'll if you tell me whose community is and then I'll like I'll I'll remove the comment real quick. Thanks, Max. And I'm going to erase that, too, just so you don't get involved in, uh, you know, so nobody blames you. <clears throat> you know, when you have a low dose of vape, you could just vape all day, but it's probably not good for you. I got these little flavors from a friend. Oh, hold on. Well, thank you, absent minded. I got these little flavors recently. Um, oh, I'm missing one. I don't know where it went. Um, cannibal nectar, flint stoned, and um, striped gum. But the nicotine levels are all like six milligrams which I guess is, like, kind of high um, for, like, people who vape all day, like me. So I only add, like, a drop of it. Like, I, um, it's under my name. Hold on. It's under my name. Huh. Maybe you could get, like, a spinal stimulator type thing. Yeah, you guys can all add me. If I don't respond right away, though, please don't get mad, because a lot of people have my Facebook, and it's really hard to keep up sometimes. I just typed it right up top, like, uh, one, two, three, four, five, five up. Five from the very last. I have anxiety, too. It's hard to not inhale it. Because then I just feel like I'm doing nothing. It feels weird. Like unnatural. Well, like, <laughs> like that. <laughs> I 
Yay! Pixie's here! Woohoo! And Brian! Great, you're leaving already? You just got here! Don't leave yet! I'm gonna get off soon anyways. I will, I'll read it. I got my phone next to me. I'm about to get off anyways. I got a lot of stuff to do today. Paperwork to fill out and stuff like that. Do with who? With Pixie? I know she's like gone again. She came and she left. Ugh. Um, Emily, I don't really feel comfortable talking about that. Um, but I what I can tell you is that it is a um I got a peak and trough done, a blood test, and my dose is decent for where I am for my body. I actually could be on a little more. Scientifically. Are you? Do you want to get off completely? Yeah, email me, Don. That's awesome, Emily. The lower you can get, the better. Yeah, my leg's hurting really bad today. That's why I'm about to get off, because I can't sit like this for much longer. It's hard, and I'm going to lay down. Oops, I accidentally turned it off when I was doing that. <laughs> Same, Amber. Oh, please be careful doing that, Emily. Please be careful. I am not a doctor, so I don't want to give you any, like, medical, like, advice. But if I can say, that is going to be painful. Very painful. Like, if you, especially, if you do cold turkey right now, you could get hurt. Please be careful. And even in half, that's, that's a, t that's a tough move. Boo, you whore. <laughs> I, everybody knows the mean girl. But yeah, why won't they help you go down and like um mm. um no okay because the methadone is supposed to do that like how it like first of all before doing that you should see methadone is supposed to hold you until the following morning or afternoon that's how it's designed it's supposed to be that way um that's how it's supposed to work 
And it doesn't really work that way where if you cut it in half, like it'll, it's not like that. Um, you know, just by doing like a 10 milligram change could make a world of a difference. So, like that's, methadone's a really weird medication, but like, um, like if I go down 10 milligrams or go up 10 milligrams, anyone, it could, and you get a peak and trough, you're like, it could change your levels by so much. So it's like, um, if anything, I would just start with like five or 10 milligrams. It might not seem like a lot, but like start with maybe 10 and then like in two or three days, cause that's when you're going to start to feel it. You, and you will, um, see how you feel. And if you feel okay, I would try in three more days, 10 milligrams and see if you can do it. And if, and if you feel comfortable, but I can tell you right now, I can promise you, promise you that if you just cut your dose in half or if you're going to feel it in like, and not, maybe not right away, but within a couple of days, it's going to be bad. Please be careful. Please be careful. Okay, Courtney, I'll talk to you later. I know, I know, Ashley. Like, I just was like, fuck it, I'm going to send you videos instead. Yeah, it is one of the hardest things to come off of Amber because it does store on your bones. Uh, the Samsung 9, the Galaxy 9, I have the 9 Plus, and it is a really good camera. That's what I stream on sometimes. I got it specifically just for, if you get an unlocked one, they're really cheap. Um, obviously, like, one of my friends said it, it was like, if you buy one, you get another one for free. So that's how I was, it was like, I had not, and I gave them a little bit of money. I didn't pay for the whole thing by myself. It was like, it was actually my parents' money, but it's whatever, same difference. They helped me buy it off of them so I can use it for camera and stuff. Can't really take any credit. Most things. My parents get credit for most. All right. I'm going to go, you guys. I love you so, so much. I love all of you guys so much. And I will talk to you guys in a little bit. Um, I'm going to be uploading a video tonight. And I'm going to be uploading a whole bunch of stuff on Patreon today, too. Um, I love you guys. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Sorry that I cut this so quick, but bye. And Emily, I don't know if you're still here, um, but you should subscribe and hit the notification bell. And like, um, I'm really interested to see, you know, what happens with that situ with your methadone situation. I really want to. I'm really interested to know, and I hope you do well. Um, I really do hope you do well. If you can do it then very, I, I would be like, um, I would be so happy. I'd be amazed, but I'd be happy because being on nothing is obviously, um, you know, ideal, but I just, uh, I, I want to, I would love to see like how it works out. So I'll talk to you guys later. You guys have a great day and I love you guys so much. Bye.